The mystery of not speed unraveled. Hello, dear learners. Today, we're going to dive into a slightly nautical phrase, not speed. Though it might sound confusing at first, by the end of this video, you'll understand it like a seasoned sailor. Let's set sail and explore the world of not speed. First things first, let's talk about the word knot. When you think of a knot, you might picture tying shoelaces or a rope. However, in nautical terms, a knot refers to a unit of speed. It's used predominantly in aviation and maritime contexts to indicate how fast a ship or an aircraft is moving. A knot means one nautical mile per hour. A nautical mile is slightly longer than a regular or statute mile that we use on land. The history of measuring speed at sea is fascinating. Since the Earth is a sphere, well, an oblate spheroid, navigating on it is a bit different than walking in a straight line on land. Sailors of old used a method involving a log and a line with knots tied at regular intervals to estimate their speed. When the log was thrown into the sea, they'd measure how many knots on the line were let out in a specific amount of time. Thus, the term knot was born. It's essential to understand that while miles or kilometers per hour might be prevalent on land, the knot is the standard at sea and in the air because of these historical and practical reasons. Knowing about knots is great, but sometimes you might need to convert them to more familiar units. Here's a simple guideline. One knot is approximately 1.15 miles per hour, MPH. One knot is about 1.85 kilometers per hour, kilometer per hour. So, if a ship is moving at 10 knots, it's roughly moving at 11.5 miles per hour or 18.5 kilometers per hour. And there we have it. Now you know that knot speed isn't about how quickly you can tie your shoelaces but a unique way of measuring speed in the air and at sea. We hope this video has shed light on this nautical term and made your English language learning journey a bit more exciting. Until next time, fair winds and following seas.